Can you see it? Can you see it? Can you see it? Can you see it? <laughs> oh my gosh, I wrote a luxury guide for my favorite travel blog ever, Hippie in Heels. I will definitely link it below. I'm so proud that Rachel wanted to feature my luxury guide. By the way, don't click on the link if <laughs> you don't want to spend money because all of these places are very awesome in Amsterdam and I love to hang out there. So yeah, that's just a warning. But if you do love luxury and you love luxury places, you know, I tend to travel simple, but I also love to hang out at fancy places and dress up and wear makeup and wear heels. So yeah, then if you do like it, you should definitely click the link. Ah, look at that, that's me. Yes, I received some products from Color Science, the most popular brand for mineral makeup in America to try out. So what do we have here? This is the primer and it has SPF as well. Then we have the foundation and then we have here the, what is this, the setting powder and this is the setting mist. So let me just demonstrate this. And I have a complexion to be very jealous of. I mean, who wouldn't want these breakouts? I've even seen YouTube tutorials on how to recreate these breakouts on flawless skin, you know. but. I'm still going to try to cover it up to see how good these products are. So let's start off with a face primer. Let me open it. Ooh, I like pump bottles. I'll just take one pump. Ooh, already has some color. Look at that. So I'm applying the primer in order to make sure the makeup stays on for a longer period of time. Um, it has some silicones in it, I have to be honest, even though it's mineral makeup. but. You know, not all silicones are bad for your skin. This glides on nicely. Now let's continue with the foundation. It's also a pump packaging. I love those. I always use two pumps of foundation because you know, those breakouts need some coverage. I love the color of this one because it's a yellow undertone and it's exactly what my skin needs. Ooh, look at this. Wow, it's really thick. This is crazy coverage. Wow, wow, I love this. I can still see my breakouts though, but I'll fix it with concealer in a couple of minutes. It's a very thick formula, but still I can easily apply it all over my face. Nice. I'm just using a random concealer which I've had for quite some while and you can already see. It's been used with love. I always have to use concealer in the inner corner of my eyes because I have very dark circles around my eyes and it just makes it look like I'm more alive and I don't look like Uncle Fester from the Adams family. Well, in, in the first grade of high school, some guy called me like Uncle Fester. Well, who's laughing now? I can fix my dark circles with concealer, but you can conceal your bad personality. As you can see, the foundation gives good coverage, but I still have to use concealer on the biggest breakouts. Already that's the base, now let's mattify it with the mattifying powder. Also this has sunscreen in it which I really love and I can also take this with me on my travels because it's a powder and that would work really well in uh, humid conditions. And, oh and you guys already know how much I love these like retractable brushes. I love this. Can you see the powder? It automatically comes out. Can you see like the dust waves? Okay, let me just apply it. It has like a faint smell, but not too much, which is good, which means there's not much perfume in it. It's really nice that the powder comes out automatic. On the other side, I have no idea like how much I'm putting on. It's not much powder coming out of it, but it's just like should I keep applying? Should I stop? It does feel nice. I just checked in the mirror and I think this is enough. 
My face looks matte. What do you think? Shininess here. Okay. It's time for the final product, setting mist, and I love this product. I always use it with my makeup in general. It's nice to use it when you have like layers of makeup on. So now I have primer, foundation, and setting powder, which feels good on my skin, but the setting mist always makes it feel better and also more, it blends more with my skin. It makes it look more natural. So no cakey looks or anything. So. Good, good. Oh wow, this is very fine mist. It smells nice, but it also means that there's perfume in it. So if you're allergic, just so you know. This is also very nice to use in hot weather. So this is the base. I'm just going to finish up my eyeshadow and blusher and stuff like that. And I'll be back with you in a minute. Oh wait, let me just show you one other trick for all my fellow other dark circles around the eyes, fellow Uncle Fester girls out there. <laughs> I always use a little bit of um, highlighter powder in the corner where it's really dark so this really lights up my eyes and that's how you brighten up dark uncle fester circles around your eyes oh my gosh this is my hair i did i haven't done anything with it since thursday except wear it in a bun when i sleep and then i you know then i untie the bun and it's it's like this, it's like perfect hair. What is going on? Arvia is like magic. As you can see, like most of the blemishes are covered, but of course I put some extra concealer on top. Uh, overall, I really like the products. I love mineral makeup in general because it's supposed to cause less breakouts on your skin if your skin is prone to breakouts. I used to use a lot of mineral makeup during my Skin War 1, <laughs> which was around like when I was maybe 20, 21, something like that. And then my skin completely cleared up and like, I don't know, since a year or two, it's breaking out again. And I hope this makeup will help to calm my skin down. Alrighty, let's go play some Cinta Glass games with the fifth pandas. <gasps> Hello! Oh my gosh, three packs of cocoa, like all kinds of paper note, kruid note, everything. Marshmallows for the hot cocoa, presents uh -huh. over here, and, mm -hmm. and something special, brownies, yes. It's a Dutch food party. So, Gregor, explain to me, you have like a bear claw over there, mm -hmm. I think. And this is a case souffle, <laughs> a cheese souffle <laughs> with old cheese, mm -hmm. fries with uh, hot, hot chicken. chicken, and I have uh, this is called patatje ordo, so it's basically fries. This is Belgian fries with mayonnaise, uh, satay like sauce, and so peanut sauce and uh, and onions. And I also have a cheese souffle, <laughs> but with regular souffle, <laughs> case souffle. <laughs> and um, Mashi has, what is this? Like fr fries, again, the Belgian version with, ketchup. also war, with ketchup and war. mayonnaise. No, 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 war is, um, but what is, oh, this is special. special. This is special. But I mayonnaise don't think it's called war anymore. It's war. It's, it's war. No. It's war. Do you know why oh, it's called no, war? No, but it's not called war anymore. They, what is it called then? Flip. Oh, because war was racist, mm -hmm. you know? Well, yeah, it was. Racist? Yeah, because do you know why it was called war? The whites against it. Mm. Ah. Yes, apartheid. And Stefan has, like, you also have the... Bear claw. Bear claw and mayonnaise and peanut sauce? Yes. So this is Sinterklaas for adults. We all bought gifts for five euro the budget was five euro and you can buy as many gifts as you want so you can buy 10 gifts for five euro or you can just buy one gift of five euro the only rule with the gifts is it has to be something you can finish so like uh, food is okay or like candles or stuff like that you cannot buy gifts which will like how do you say that which you will need to use them up. yeah need to be used up. yeah it needs to be gifts that can be used up so we have a dice and we're gonna roll the dice. In the first round, you just roll the dice to distribute the gifts. 
and only in the second round you can also open up the gifts and you can steal gifts from each other depending on what kind of number you roll on the dice it's really so much fun to do this make a jelly dice or mini dice jelly dice dice yes oh with lights oh my gosh yes three which one I'll I'll wrap it. So when you throw three, you can grab a present and unwrap it. Oh, nice! What is it? Yeah, I... <laughs> I just what I always wanted. So all the gifts are distributed and we're unwrapping them. So I have a um, lighter, glue, just rubber <laughs> elastics <laughs> what is this oh this is really disgusting i think this is typically dutch it's like candy paper you can eat it it's super and cooling yummy. vinegar yes you can have it candy. like if i win it you will get it i, I don't want this i really don't like it. what do you have what is it these are big ass matches <laughs> Give me the Texas accent. Ta Wait, oh my gosh. Gotcha. <laughs> Show me. What do you have? <laughs> candy G string. Candy. And the good stuff. Candy good stuff. This one, I will be fighting for this one. It's the, the candy Swedish stuff. candy, the IKEA candy, the dime candy, and like bay ass matches. What's That's yours right. is mine. Stay from one the mother load. Like I wanted to battle oh. for this. Oh, and we have the toothpaste oh. and the Scented candles, and I just won this, so it's good. We married, like, in theory. <laughs> and they have no, they don't. They have like just a okay. So, okay, 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 I have to film this. So, they bought um, what is it, a lottery ticket? So, let's see if we won 25k. Go if there's 25k, we're going on a road trip, the four of us. 25k? Ah, mm -hmm. oh, but it's always like. No, I don't think so. Wait even. Find you one time gratis and win a class. Oh, we have a gratis lot. Ooh, another free lottery ticket. 25. No way. No way. Will you three have? Hey, but I have not. Nah. Nog een tientje, nog een tientje. Yeah, but you have to three times. It's too bad. Okay, so we want a free lottery ticket. Yay. Maybe the next one. We were playing a knockoff of Cards Against Humanity and I win, yes! Oh my gosh, look at this advent calendar. It's so cute, it's like a book. Look at this, look at this. It's adorable and I can open some dates. Let me see which one. Guess the date I'm gonna open. So let's open up six because that's today. Let me see. Yeah. Oh wait, there's the door. See. Oh my gosh, there's like stuff in it. I thought it was just chocolates. Oh wow. Okay, this is really nice stuff actually. I uh, used to have a sample. For all the people asking me why I vlog in English or saying, please go back to Dutch. Cheers, this is for you. I was not joking about a drinking game. Perfect, awesome Sunday night. Thank you. It was a really nice shot. Thank you. This is my makeup after Is it more than eight hours longer eight hours for sure um, You can see like only my forehead is shiny, but my forehead is always like extremely oily But the rest of the makeup is still like oh you can see like the concealer is gone but It's still all right. It feels nice Okay we're going to Paris on Wednesday, Mon Chéri. So tomorrow no vlog, on Tuesday no vlogs. I'll see you on Wednesday again. Mwah. Bye. Mwah.